Aha, gotcha. I bet you thought it was a dinosaur. And it was, just not a real one. Dinosaurs died out millions of years ago. They're extinct. But how did that happen? How did dinosaurs become extinct? Hmm? The dinosaurs became extinct because of a big comet. They ran out of food and there was no food left on the earth. They ran out of food and also um, that all the plants died because there was no water. Because of a big comet that blacked up the sky. There was grass and they ate mo all of the grass and then there was none. Hey, some good answers there. But you know what I think? I think. Dinosaurs scared each other to death. I mean, they're scary things. <coughs> exactly. Oh, but hang on. Then there would be one dinosaur left. The scariest one that scared all the others. So there goes that theory. Hmm. Hey, when did dinosaurs become extinct? Now, you might think that humans have been around for a very long time. And to a point, you're right. But let's put it into perspective. Imagine that this calendar represents history, from when dinosaurs first appeared on the scene to now. And each of these days represents just under a million years. That's right, one day equals a million years. Now I know what you're thinking, you're thinking, gosh, that's excessive, that's a bit over the top. But not when you're talking in terms of dinosaurs. Now, Let's say that dinosaurs started here at the beginning of the calendar. January the 1st is when dinosaurs started to appear. And they were around for about 165 million years. So that's about this many days. Here we go. In about mid-September on our dino calendar, there was a huge dinosaur disaster. Dinosaurs died out. They became extinct. No more, not a single one. Hey, but what about us humans? Where are we on the calendar? Ha, here we are, right at the end of the calendar. When you think of it like that, we haven't been around for very long at all, have we? So, dinosaurs became extinct about 65 million years ago. But why was that? Why did they start dying out? Well, the answer is... Well, the answer is this. Well, actually, there is no one clear answer. But there are lots of guesses, scientific guesses, based on facts. Facts that we get from things like fossils and bones and things like that. Because 65 million years ago, there weren't any humans around and they weren't taking any notes or pictures. But here's theory number one, and this is called the mammal theory. Around that time, dinosaurs were laying eggs like birds. Then, after a while, out would hatch a baby dinosaur. Oh. But there was one problem about that. Around that time, there were also a lot of rodent-like mammals being born. And the thing that these guys loved to eat the most was, you guessed it, dinosaur eggs. So as fast as the dinosaurs were laying eggs, those rodent-like mammals were eating them. And pretty soon, all the adult dinosaurs died out and there were no babies to grow up. And that's what happened to the dinosaurs. Well, that's one theory anyway. The mammal theory. You know, another theory is that dinosaurs simply became too big. They grew. 
and grow. And grow. Until they got so big that they couldn't hunt. <sighs> oh, I'm hungry. Oh. Ooh, cupcake. I love cupcake. Oh, oh, I can't reach cupcake. Oh no, I'm too big. Theory number three, the plant theory. Now for millions and millions of years, plants were the food source of the herbivore dinosaurs. They were the dinosaurs that only ate plants. Oh, me herbivore dinosaur, me eat plant. Mmm, good plant. Mm, 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 mm. And in turn, the herbivore dinosaurs were the food source of the carnivore dinosaurs. Oh, very good. Oh. Mmm, fresh dinosaur meat. Mmm, I'm a carnivore dinosaur and I love fresh dinosaur meat. Oh, look. Delicious. <laughs> Well, well, anyway, after millions and millions of years, those plants didn't want to be the main food source anymore, so they devised a tricky plan. They evolved and became poisonous plants. Now, the poor old herbivore dinosaurs were so used to eating these plants that they didn't realise they were poisoned, and they carried on eating them. Oh, plant! Very good plant! Oh, mm, tasty! A bit spicy, mm, what's that red stuff? Mm, it's still good. And eventually, they all died out. <laughs> and then there's this theory. Now imagine that this is the Earth, and these are the dinosaurs that roam the Earth's surface. is a meteorite. Now, a meteorite is a stony, metallic object from outer space that comes crashing into the Earth's surface. And 65 million years ago, it's believed the meteorite did just that. It came crashing into the Earth's atmosphere <laughs> and created a huge crater in the Earth's surface. Now, the impact killed hundreds of dinosaurs straight away. But more importantly was the iridium that was sent up into the Earth's atmosphere from the meteorite. Now, iridium is a very rare, very dense metal that you get with meteorites. And the iridium filled the atmosphere, covering the whole Earth. It blocked out the sun and created a very long, very harsh, very cold winter. Because of the long winter, there was no sunlight and all the plants died. Because all the plants died, all the herbivores died. And because all the herbivores died, all the carnivores died. And that means there were no dinosaurs left. Well, that's that theory anyway. Now, although we don't know exactly why the dinosaurs became extinct, we do know that there are lots of different theories. Why don't you do some investigation and see if you can find out what some of the other theories are? Or see if you can think of any animals alive today that look a bit like dinosaurs. I can think of one, the tuatara. Can you think of one? Maybe you've got some questions that you'd like answered. You can write to us at Susie's World, P.O. Box 34307, Birkenhead, Auckland. Or head to the website, www.susie.co. Dot NZ. Another investigation complete. Hey, didn't we say every single dinosaur became extinct? Oh, I certainly hope so. Right, I'm out of here. Can't you think? It's from when dinosaurs first arrived, about to say elephants for some reason. Why don't you do some investigation? That's theory number three. This program was made with funding from New Zealand On Air.